Run the code online or download from codegive.com, link in the description below. Title, A Beginner's Guide to User Input in Python Introduction User input is a crucial aspect of many Python programs, allowing interaction and customization. In this tutorial, we'll explore various ways to receive and handle user input in Python, covering both simple and more advanced scenarios. The simplest way to get user input is by using the built-in input function. It reads a line of text from the user and returns it as a string. In this example, the input function displays the prompt enter something and waits for the user to type something. The entered text is then stored in the user underscore input variable and printed. By default, input returns a string. If you need the input as a different data type, such as an integer or float, you can use type conversion. Here, the int function is used to convert the user input to an integer, allowing mathematical operations. To receive multiple inputs from a user, you can use the split method and list unpacking. In this example, the user is prompted to enter their name and age separated by a space. The split method splits the input into a list, and then we unpack the list into variables name and age. In some cases, it might be more convenient to pass input as command line arguments. This script checks if command line arguments are provided and prints the first argument if available. Conclusion These are basic methods for handling user input in Python. Depending on your program's complexity, you might need more advanced techniques, such as error handling or input validation. Understanding these fundamentals will give you a solid foundation for creating interactive Python applications. ChatGPT